American Environmental Fabrication and Supply would like to take this opportunity to introduce the GRIP. The GRIP, or Gas Reduction Injection Process Equipment, is manufactured as a top-of-the-line fuel gas conditioning system. The GRIP Fuel Gas Conditioning System is a newly developed non-mechanical process for reducing high BTU natural gas streams into acceptable lower BTU fuel sources. What if you could fuel any number, name brand or type of piston configuration, natural gas compressor engines with any natural gas transmission transporting fuel with fluctuating high BTU natural gas? How would this affect your compressor engine purchasing habits? This would allow you to purchase any readily available compressor engine with any configuration or RPM speed without worry if the equipment will function to nameplate specifications. What if you could minimize costly engine maintenance on all your natural gas fueled engines that currently run on high BTU and wet natural gas liquids? The GRIP system allows you to operate at recommended engine specifications and be free of costly downtime, revenue loss, and associated mechanical repairs. This will allow your company to continue producing natural gas without concern over unforeseen compressor engine difficulty or major engine repairs, which typically is associated with high BTU fuel gas. What if? You could expect your natural gas fueled engines to run at or close to nameplate horsepower ratings and normal published manufacturers EJW and TAW, heat loads and exhaust emission value. This would allow you to operate your engines at much higher RPMs without derating the compressors, thus increasing natural gas production without any added equipment. The added natural gas production will minimize the amount of compressor equipment required at the transmission site or reduce the current size of the compressors. The GRIP system will allow you to remove the unnecessary compressors to a new transmission site. By removing the unnecessary compressors, which are not required at the site, operating costs, supervision, parts, repair, and maintenance will be reduced significantly. What if? You could minimize engine exhaust pollution by reducing NOx, VOC, and CO emissions without having to improve your catalytic options. With the newer stationary engine pollution regulations being more restrictive and effective late this year, reducing engine exhaust emissions on CO, NOx, and unspent VOCs will be of benefit with the RICE, NSPS, and NES HAP. The GRIP system reduces unspent hydrocarbons and NOx emissions while extending the life of the catalyst. These catalytic costs may be reduced by 50%. When reviewing the slide illustration, the natural gas compressor engine was operating on 1300 plus BTUs per cubic foot, having a 15% ethane value. You will notice that as the engine's temperature increases, the NOx and CO emissions rise as well. It is important to remove these higher hydrocarbons. This will reduce any possible engine predetonation, increase the compressor's horsepower by as much as 25%, and reduce NOx and CO exhaust emissions. What if you don't have to dispose of separated wet gases and NGLs, which are typically seen in membrane-type fuel gas conditioning systems? With the GRIP system, there is no wet gases or NGLs which need to be disposed of or removed in any way. With the GRIP system, you will never have to recompress wet or NGLs back into the transmission line. Additionally, there is no membrane fouling or plugging. There is no expensive membrane replacement costs. With the GRIP system, there is never a process membrane failure. You will never have to shut your compressor engines down to change out the membrane or make repairs. What if you don't have to recompress any separated wet natural gases to go back into the natural gas production line? The GRIP has no environmental disposition or collection issues as it simply converts these wet gases and NGLs. Therefore, 
There is no need to recompress, have any separation systems, filters, collection vessels, or any other associated equipment necessary for reintroduction or collection of these small amounts of wet natural gases. By not having to reintroduce these wet natural gases into the transmission line or collection system, there is significant cost saving versus any minimal profits which may be made on these small amounts of wet natural gases. When comparing the grip system benefits over the decades-old Jewel Thompson skids, there is really no comparison. The grip technology requires no valve throttling process, does not use differential pressure controllers, requires no pressurized wet gas product tank, is simplified without use of temperature controllers, and has no PID loop parameters, which need adjustment. In addition, there is no gas-to-gas -gas exchanger required. The grip system is not affected by large temperature changes that cause the compressor to increase in discharge pressures. The grip system is not affected by hydrocarbon dew point changes, which often occur in the ever-changing transmission natural gases. Listed below are some of the benefits of the grip system over refrigeration chiller systems. The grip system has no inlet or outlet gas interchangers or separators, requires no chiller unit or methanol injection pumps, has no filter coalescence or refrigeration compressor, has no liquid product booster pump or refrigerant condenser. The GRIP unit is a very simplified gas conditioning system requiring no cryogenic refrigeration, no complex electrical control systems or PID controlling loops, no stabilizer column or storage vessels, no pressure control system or reflex system. The GRIP system uses a proprietary developed oxidation conversion material that with compressed air converts specific heavier hydrocarbons into HTO and a small amount of less than 1% inert carbon dioxide. The GRIP system produces water as the byproduct in the transformation of the select NGLs and heavier hydrocarbons. The GRIP system only requires 1 to 2 pounds of this low-cost conversion material every 30 to 60 days. This material can be added without interruption and only requires a few minutes to complete the task. The GRIP system operates on any natural gas stream with an operating pressure between 60 and 200 PSIG. The GRIP system requires a small amount of compressed air. The air requirement for continual operation on 115,000 cubic feet per day at 1400 BTU per cubic foot is 5 cubic feet per minute at 5 PSIG above the desired operating natural gas pressure. By reducing the amount of heavy hydrocarbons delivered to the compressor engine, you will increase engine longevity and site available horsepower, thus consistently increasing the compressor package's overall output and revenue stream. As part of the conversion process, the GRIP system provides a small amount of pure inert nitrogen, void of oxygen. This small amount of nitrogen increases the engine's thermal efficiency while cooling the engine's internal combustion process. This allows the engine to run without pre-detonation and reduces NOx and CO formation. The addition of nitrogen has proven to increase natural gas engine life and enhance engine fuel compressibility. The GRIP system allows the end user or compressor packager to select any desired natural gas compressor engine. GRIP systems can be placed in parallel, creating any required natural gas throughput. The GRIP system can also be operated in series to reduce very high 1750 BTU per cubic foot fuel gas. The GRIP reduces natural gas compressor emissions to assist in meeting the new compliance regulations. The system has very low electrical consumption, 2 amps at 110 volts AC with a solar-powered option available. 
The GRIP system is a low-cost, non-complex fuel gas conditioning solution with no reinsertion or collection of wet natural gas from the natural gas transmission line. The GRIP requires minimal system maintenance with annual operating times of over 8,700 hours per year. The GRIP system is fabricated under Class 1, Division 2 manufacturing and electrical guidelines and is safe to operate in all hazardous industrial locations. The GRIP system reduces natural gas compressor downtime and is not subjected to power grid failures or blackouts. The GRIP has no costly repair parts. The inexpensive parts and maintenance can be completed by non-technical personnel. Listed below are some of the benefits you will receive when using the GRIP gas conditioning system. The GRIP system has a very portable design with a footprint of 8 foot wide by 8 foot long and 8 foot 6 inches in height. The GRIP footprint is much smaller than competitive conditioning products. The system can easily be moved and set up within a couple of hours and is ready for new natural gas conditioning operations. The GRIP attachment made to the compressor is not complicated and requires only connecting the inlet and outlet 2-inch pipe located just outside the skid area and a 3 8 inch air tube connection used to operate the air valves and system operating requirements. The GRIP system has an optional cold weather package. Included in the cold weather package is a Class 1 Division 2 flameless gas heater and operates on a very small amount of the GRIP's conditioned fuel gas. The system is totally enclosed to protect all system components from extreme cold weather. The GRIP system is manufactured with hazardous Class 1 Division 2 specifications and may be powered in remote locations using a 24-volt solar panel power supply. For those companies which would like to monitor the outlet condition gas feeds to the compressor's engine, we offer a V-cone gas flow meter with a rose mount transmitter option. The transmitter's output is a 4 to 20 milliamp signal and may be used for remote gas monitoring purposes. The grip unit is completely powder coated for performance against weather and field gas emissions. The system requires no future painting and is built to last for decades. The grip is manufactured in America with the highest standards and uses American manufactured parts, offering the highest quality. We offer a full 36-month unconditional repair warranty against any manufacturing defects and a full one-year parts and labor on all system components. The GRIP system allows for BTU operating adjustments to control the output value of the existing conditioned gas to the compressor. This is the only truly adjustable flow and pressure conditioning fuel system which offers the ability to vary the BTU output on the market today. The system is not subject to electrical blackouts and power failures and is very inexpensive to operate and reduce high BTU fuel gas with conversion costs of approximately $80 per month. We hope that you find, like many others, that the GRIP system is an attractive solution for your gas conditioning needs and look forward to discussing your applications and serving our clients. Please contact your GRIP system representative. We would like to say thank you for taking the time and reviewing the product.